Numerical Methods Problem 15.12 An automobile company has two versions of the same model car for sale, a two-door coupe and a full-size four-door. A. Graphically solve how many cars of each design should be produced to maximize profit and what that profit is. B. Solve the same problem with Excel. So, we have a two-door car and a four-door car. And the problem also gives us some constraints. The first constraint is that the profit for each car is equal to 13500 and 15000 for car 1 which is the two door car and 15000 for car 2 which is the four door car our production time is equal to 15 hours per car to make car 1 20 hours to make car 2 and the total production time has to be less than 8,000. We can store 400 cars of the two-door and 350 cars of the four-door. And then we have our ratio for consumer demand, which we have 700 for the two-door and 500 for the four-door. And the total amount of cars that we can make is has to be less than 240,000. I mean, t yeah, 240,000. So, the first thing we plot up is our total production time over our time to build a car which is equal to the total number of each car that can be made which is here. And then our second plot is the total cars over the consumer demand per car which is equal to the total number of each car demanded which we plot here. Also we have the constraints down here of our storage constraints that we must plot up. 400 for the two door and 350 for the four door. And here is where we expect to intersect. So here's our graph. Here are our constraints in black, 350 for the four-door going here, 400 for the two-door. Then we have the total number of each car that can be made here in our red plot. And then we have the total number of demand for each car here in our green plot and so where those intersect is the total number of cars that we should make for each which is at 307 and 123. So the problem asks, asks us to also solve it with Excel. So we bring up Excel we set up our equations for Excel. We have our two-door and our four-door car 
as our variables. Then we have our total profit equation, which is 13,500 for the two-door car and 15,000 for the four-door car. And then our product time is equal to 15 times the two-door car plus 20 times the four-door car. And when we have our consumer demand, which is 700 times the two-door car and 500 times the four-door car. So we go into our solver, click on total profit, go into our solver. Notice that we're trying to maximize total profit is what we're, we clicked on. And so the set object will be what we clicked on and we set it to max because we want to maximize the profit. And then our variables are the amount of the two-door car, which is B2, and the four-door car, which is B3. And then we add the other constraints given to us by the problem. Our first is that we must have less than or equal to 400 cars for the two-door. And we use an integer value for the two-door car because you can't have half of a car. And then we do the same. We have a 350 car constraint for the four-door car and we use an integer value for the four-door car because we can't have half of the four-door car either. And then we have our production time constraint because we only have 8,000 total hours. And then we have our consumer demand constraint which is an availability of 240,000 cars. So now that we have all our constraints set up, we click Solve. Solver solves the problem. And it gives us 123 for the two-door cars and 307 cars for the four-door cars. And it also calculates our time, our consumer demand, and what we were looking for, our total profit, So our total profit is 6,265,500 and that is it for problem 15.12 in numerical methods.